West Coast Black Theater Troupe broke ground on their new renovation today, and it's providing even more opportunities for kids and community members. SNN's Samantha Sonner has the story. Campers at West Coast Black Theater Troupe are getting their performance ready. This time next year, they'll be rehearsing in brand new studios. With the renovation, it will give us comfortable studios with air conditioning where these kids can have even a, a, a better experience and more focused environment. WBTT founder and artistic director Nate Jacobs says education is one of their most important missions. If we don't perpetuate our stories, if we don't... Uh, take care of propagating that information throughout generations, then the stories are not told. Right now, summer camp is mainly for teenagers, but the renovations can help expand the program. Well, I don't want to miss the kids because, you know, in those vital years, three and four years old, when they're most impressionable, is when you want to touch their lives. The first phase of the $6 million planned renovation will also put administrative offices and a box office in the Bins building. Between the two buildings, we're going to have a, a large courtyard. That'll be the main entrance to both buildings now, and that'll be great for intermission time, lovely courtyard to go out and enjoy yourselves. The first part of the renovation will be primarily in the front building, but the second part will deal with the theater itself. Phase two is the interior of the theater, and we know theater patrons would be very excited about our plans for that. So come and help us. They are still $2 million away from their total fundraising goal. What I am living today is what I saw 18 years ago. And my mind is like, oh my God, it's actually happening. Dreams really do come true. Dreams coming true with a lot of hard work. Reporting in Sarasota, I'm Samantha Sonner, SNN, the Suncoast News Network. And West Coast Black Theater Troupe is still collecting money to complete those renovations. And there's more information on how you can help at our website, snntv.com.